a successful takeoff for Virgin Galactic here in New Mexico. The company launched its first ever commercial space flight on Thursday, almost 20 years after it was founded by Richard Branson. Aboard the rocket-powered plane were three Virgin Galactic crew members, two of whom piloted the vehicle, as well as two Italian Air Force officers and an aerospace engineer who conducted science experiments during the flight. I had the opportunity to look outside and the view, it was amazing, fantastic. Uh, this is the first time that we uh, have the windows to the mesosphere with a, a technical, with a uh, researcher, uh, with a uh, possibility to uh, um, operate directly the instrumentation on board. So uh, it's a mean a lot for us. The rocket plane, named Unity, reached an altitude of more than 80 kilometers at the top of its climb. It's not the first ever commercial space flight. Jeff Bezos's company, Blue Origin, which has sent 32 people into orbit, beat Virgin Galactic in the race to take paying passengers into space. But Thursday's launch marks a significant breakthrough for the company, which nearly folded after experiencing engineering challenges. In 2014, one of its prototype vehicles broke up during a test flight, killing one of the two pilots on board. In August, the company plans to begin sending up the 800 or so people who have bought tickets, which are advertised at $450,000.